So we get matched up when we're about rank 15 against a uh, ultimately huge guy Giganticus player, but that is the power of aggro solar flare being such a strong meta deck. We pull off the fair and square victory, and that was about getting any early game either. Got him. What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today is day two of the brand new free-to-play account named Totally Not Fry. Uh, today we, uh, and last time we actually got all the way up to rank 10. It took about a three hour stream. Uh, as you can see we are rank 10. The goal is to see how long it'll take now to get to rank 20. We are totally min-maxing, which means we are uh, the minimum amount of content in one deck. Really, we're going to try to build it to the maximum potential. Uh, we did get really lucky pulling a Valk in a deck yesterday, which actually gave us all four of our Haunted Pumpkins, because you can spark Valk for uh, 4,000 sparks. That was amazing. Uh, so we're going to continue to uh, grind the ranks. This is a really, really powerful, of course, aggro solar flare, one of the best budget decks in the entire game, uh, just using whatever resources we have. Uh, the main things we're missing from this deck uh, right now are um, some kind of good one drop, maybe poison ivy. I'm thinking also maybe blooming uh, heart. Uh, blooming heart would, have, would be like the most ideal, but if we don't get blooming heart, we could use, again, poison shroom and um, might even use like morning glory. Uh, which is a 1-2-2 two, two flower, which is pretty decent in the late game. We'll see about that. Uh, we could also use for the 2 slot, we're going to try to craft. The next card I'm really going to craft is 3 more copy, copies of Apple Saucer. This is a really, really powerful, both in early and late game. Uh, some Wild Berries would be nice. Uh, besides that, the only card we're really missing is Power Flower for the late game, which is a rare. So as we sort of gain uh, gems, we're going to be buying premium packs. Hopefully we'll get a card we need. If not, we're gonna, basically going to be sparking everything in order to create this one deck. Uh, the goal is to hit at least Taco League. Maybe I'll even grind this uh, account up to Ultimate League. Here we go. Let's just get right into the ranked games. Uh, now, if we look at our quests, it seems like our quests are a little bit limited because uh, we don't didn't have... You actually can't skip this quest with the Super Brains. I don't feel like winning two games of Super Brains. Let's just, let's just go right into the games. Here we go. Oh, how did I get Haunted Pumpkin? Yeah, so I crafted those four. Again, that's a really powerful aggro solar flare card to craft. I did pull a Valk in the deck, uh, which is a nerfed, recently nerfed card, so it gives you 4,000 sparks. Uh, we're really going to be hard mulliganing for some early game here. We're up against a rank 9 person. We did have some really unfair matchups the other day. Um, happy to actually go against someone in our rank. Now, if we go 1, 2, 3, it's not bad. It's not bad. Oh. We'll see if uh, Boogaloo can't deal, or decides not to deal with the Sunflower. Yes! That's actually really good for us. Because now, we're able to play do uh, put a 5 attack minion on the field, both on turns 2 and 3, which is going to do a lot of damage. Can I have your old account then? <laughs> I'm definitely going to go back after I'm done with the series to the old account. I just thought this would be a really, really fun idea. That happened. Wow, look at this guy. Um, it'd be really nice to play the Poison Ivy. The problem is, what about Scorch to get rid of these cards? It's just going to be Poison Ivy next turn. And we're not going to have a lane for it. This is rough. Yeah, it seems like the Nox, which is that I'm actually not playing this on my phone in side sync as usual. I'm playing this on Nox, which is an Android emulator. Uh, you can download that for PC. Um, it seems like Nox doesn't do a very does the internet doesn't connect as quickly or something like that. There's a little more latency, and it always just uh, calls. It's, it doesn't load the opponent's names. It's just loading Disco for freaking Boogaloo and Gargantua for Smash. Here we go. Hopefully, it does not have a lightning bolt power. Harsh. Uh, I, I find this deck does struggle against the crazy heroes because they just have ways to deal. They end up being control decks on this level of the game. We're gonna have to squash this eventually. Man, there's that. I think we go with the 5 damage while we have it. He does not have a way of dealing with this now. Huh. 
This is fine. Probably gonna have to squash this now. <laughs> That's not cute, Dolphin. I'm even buyer. Ha ha ha. Bomb is doing six. Eight. This is always the play. We could go bloomering here. A little sad. We're really gonna need to block at some point. We rolled a one, a one, and a two. Ugh. This is not necessarily going to do 3 damage, which is the good news. This one. Alright, this is always the play. He really is just pulling out a pretty good aggro deck. Even if we block, we can't block both of these. This is going to be a loss. It seems against the Smash and Super Brains, we're winning a lot, and against... Uh, Boogaloo and Infinity were losing. I think when we optimize this deck, we'll be able to win these matchups too, because we're only really... The, I'll tell you the problem. We only are getting one early game card, which is Haunted Pumpkin. Uh, we really just need to increase the, the the early game. Did play three tricks. Moving on to the next. Stone. Uh, if people are new, people are coming in and asking the same questions. I'd love if the chat can answer that for them. Thank you so much. This is a rank 20, but it's a rust bolt, so it's a little bit easier. This is good against rust bolt. This is not. I have to look for a one or a three. Uh, you know what? I should have all given this. Not gonna really help us. Uh, did I not count a loss there? I think it's eight, right? Wow, having the top deck mix nuts, which is huge here. Incredible. Maybe I should I should just uh, make a business boosting boosting people's accounts. This can get chopped. This is more on curve. Weed spray doesn't do a whole lot here. Flick does, but that'll make them exposed. I'm gonna go for the curve play. Uh, this is a little bit worse against. Here it's a little bit worse against. Uh, what's it called? Black hole. We're already up against rank 20 guys, which means they could have been rank 40 last season. Nice rocket science. Nice. Nice we played the pairs instead of the uh, poison ivy. We're we're, at, we're in a really good we're in a really good uh, situation. See, they're at five and three. The sunflower is really giving us value there. So it's a little mini ramp thing. We'll have either these two. I think this is the play. Keeping this alive is pretty good. It seems like we'll have chat though. But we you know, we'll get it out of his hand anyway. Next turn we're either going to weed whack, squash, or oh that's a play. That's a really good beam me up. So what power does he have in his hand? His four powers are Rockwall, Super. I feel like he would have used Super by now. Chop. He de definitely would have used Chop there. And Heal. Maybe it's him. Here's two and three. Oh, we don't have the strike through though. Ugh. All right, it's gonna be like this. And like this. Our opponent committed all five of his brains into this 
uh, portal technician. Hopefully our opponent just gets Rockwall here. Heal would be good. Chop would be very good. Wow, he got a King of the Grill. Okay, we have a Squash for that next turn. That's pretty harsh, though. He gets Nerf. I think Nerf is the best case scenario, because it still is a 2-1. Um, a still getting that work done. There's still a possibility we're not even going to squash this, actually. Ugh. Don't have a lane. Okay, I think we have to squash that. I wonder if it's worth squashing this one. Reason being, if you can't deal with this, I don't know what's going to be in this gravestone. Probably something useless. This gladiator is going to end up preventing so much damage. I, this is really sad, but we're actually going to just take the six like a man and try to hit him for five here. There's drone engineer. Please don't have another beam me up. He has heal. That was his power he was holding. We are definitely in trouble now. Just not enough not enough damage. What do we get? This is not what we needed. We needed a cheaper card there. Oof. Now we just trade these two. He's gonna draw a card in the meantime. Now he's gonna win. That's guaranteed lethal. Come on, man. We can roll double threes. Now it's guaranteed lethal. Well, if we roll double threes and get weed whack, almost impossible to win that. Nope. 16 and 9. The struggle is real. This is when we got to rank, uh, starting off at rank 10 really, really slowly here. Can't lose stars at this. I'd love if we could somehow get past this, win two games of Super Brains quest. We're not going to be winning with our, with our stupid Super Brains gravestone deck at this rank. We just do not have enough cards. Haven't crafted a thing for him yet. I wonder if at this point it is uh, just read the title of the stream you'll figure everything out guys let's see here if we get 20 more gems we'll be able to buy another pack and maybe upgrade this deck a little bit okay I think I'm gonna actually do a little single player right now Uh, is Headstone Carver not even a basic card anymore? Oh, it used to be a basic. Watching ads. I kind of want to just open up the next uh, ones anyway. Alright. Let's play a couple of these. I want to. The, the problem is the the win two games of Super Brains is uh, clogging. Um, it's clogging some of the. Sorry, it's clogging some of the um. The 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 que the other quests from spawning. So this will actually eventually give us more value. Thank you so much, Hunky Monkey, for subscribing to Twitch Prime. Welcome to the family. We really appreciate it. We're going to smoke bomb this. Probably see if it brings it later. Doing a lot of damage here. He blitz for the five bits. Just going to try to aggro this guy. Oh my 
go. Berry blast. And small nut. This is gonna be completely useless against Bidon. Should sure you call your Smurf whatever you want? Thanks so much, Fat you Teddy, for subscribing. Opponent passes. Mini Ninja and an aggro deck. The problem is it's a really high maintenance card. It can't make a good trade. Like, ever. Smelly makes smelly face. Just gotta push for five more damage here. This is real good. I'm not count counting, by the way, any wins or losses that happen from the single player games. Uh, this is going to be the counter in the bottom. It's going to be specifically our, our ranked wins and losses. Want to try to get those gems too. Why'd I start over for fun? For funsies. Oh, these two are gonna be real good together. Right, here we go. Read the stories first. Oh, I'm gonna try to do these together eventually. Uh, I'm not going for games played actually. I'm going for the uh, I'm going for the quest that is to win two games as Super Brands. To a tray. Should I just play dry mini energy? It's too early to try. Frozen. <coughs> Needless to say, the screen shadow deck is pretty sad. This is gonna be two one and one, I guess. So we get another drone engineer, which I think we even have in this deck. It's <laughs> freezing. I did not reset my account. We are doing a started a new free to play account called Totally Not Fry. And we're gonna see how far we can take this uh, in the minimum amount of time. We're gonna get this at least to Taco League, maybe to Ultimate too. I think sacking a Mini Ninja and going for the card draw here is the right play. Probably doing nothing. Just actually doing a little single player just to complete a mission here. Wanna open up another pack. They watch anime a little bit. Just finished uh, season one of Psychopaths. Do not plan on watching much of season two. Here we go. Amazing. How do you make a new account? You get a new device. Make sure you, you back up, I mean, you can do it on the same device, make sure you back up your account with an EA.com account, but just get a new device, download PPC Heroes, and start over. Uh, I am playing this on Nox, which is an emulator. Here we go. I keep on answering the same questions over and over again. I'm going to let the chat answer the questions from now on, please, because it's new people come in every time. We did do the anti-hero ability quest. What is the next quest for Super Brains? Smoke Bomb. And that'll let us craft. Anyway. The next quest, we do have enough for a pack now. Win two games as a zombie hero. Oh, should I do more? Packy packy time! Uh, I'm gonna keep going with the premium packs. Most of the cards we need for this deck 
are in the premium set. Do not have any good ideas for Budget Boogaloo, unfortunately. Oh, we got Vanilla. Give me something good. So, actually, none of these cards are useful at all in our for our deck, so uh, we can uncraft this to be able to make a little bit of stuff, but... Hmm. Alright, I think I'm going to go for the for two more single player games here. Just to be able to get through these quests because we're going to need a... seems like we need a little more cards right now. Daily challenge? I don't know. We're going to get Walnut eventually. Maybe that'll be good for the stack. Yeah. I need help with that. Okay. Um, this is fine. All right, this is okay. Why not wait for the thousand gems? I'm just trying to do this as fast as possible. Uh, if you're looking to build your account eventually, uh, it's definitely better to wait for a thousand gems. But if you're trying to just hit Taco League as quickly as possible, it's good to buy a hundred. You'll go a lot faster that way. run ads when I'm off stream. Look how smelly here. Again, really, really requesting the people in the chat who were here yesterday uh, try to answer the questions of the people coming. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. should work. I guess that's just a clear lane. What? You didn't even block them? That was silly. In this future, all I can see their lower rank guy is that. Oh 
Dumb Stick's gonna win the game. Go. We got the scraps. What are they asking us to craft here? Stealthy? Should I just for the hero quest? Is this gonna be our last game as Super Brains? So we might as well squander the 50 sparks on something else. Probably. What is this? He starts with a torchwood? Not cool. Spell. <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. Here's a boss, guys. Boss mode activated. He doesn't give you back the sparks, though. He just gives you another copy of it. Eventually, at the end, but I'm not going to be playing much. Wow, he has electric rate. Alright guys, I'm gonna be taking a break from as answering questions in the chat for a little bit. Just gonna be playing the game here. Having some fun. This is gonna get a lot of value. Look mommy, he's not doing anything. What do we do now? What do we do? He has a freeze. This is bonus dice for you. That's Putting one attack guys in the field. I should have at least given him a little extra health or something. Let me play this and play some tricks. This paparazzi is pretty good. <laughs> now he gets all the freeze cards way too late. Okay, he's annoying. Just saying. Bring us up to eight. This will bring us up to nine. Hey, 
And we got that. <laughs> Good grocery, room, bro. Good one. All right, here we go. Do not have good ideas for budget boogaloo, so I would need to, I would need to get some kind of idea for that before doing that. Oh, that's so cruel! Look at the evil brain freeze. When is the smash? I don't have the smash. the heck? Do I have the smash? Oh, I do. How many gems do I get for that? Uh, uh, uh. Oh, look at all these scraps we have. Okay. Now we're going to do it. Now we're ready to go. We bought a useless pack and we got a little bit of scraps from Super Brains, um, Super Brains Hero Quest. And now we are going to get crafting. Here we go. Two more copies of that. Apple saucer. This will definitely help this deck a lot. Alright, here we go, here we go. Yeah, I know I almost smashed it. Let's see if we can do something in rank mode now that we've improved this deck a little bit. Really, really important game. And this is Super Brains, which is a great matchup. Really just want as many Haunted Pumpkins as possible. I'm going to be going right for the early game. Didn't get anything. Horrible starting hand. Really, really bad. Seems to be a basic common card. I don't like it. He has a line dancing zombie. What am I supposed to do about that? At least the Scorch kills it this next turn. You're useless, hunk of junk. I'm gonna scorch. Yep, still not enough early game in this deck, that is true. You are a useless hunk of junk. We actually have five now, so we can go with these three into six next turn. It's pretty good. Yes, he put another one health guy who was not playing around Scorch. This is really, really good. So we're gonna go, uh. I think we protect this. Amazing. Amazing. Super. Oh, <laughs> that's two for one. Ugh. No, he's too true. We still have the Poison Ivy for nine coming up. And we're gonna be able to squash. Oh man, this is really, really good. You think he has a big removal card? Probably not. Why did he pass turn five though? <laughs> cryo brain. Okay. Another cryo brain. This is why you do not run cryo brains in a deck ever. Unless you have an amazing turn four play that you have to do. It's usually still not worth it. Squash for the win. Gadget Scientist. Really happy to see that. Let's 
gonna be squash and pumpkin. This could actually give him an alienus, which would be sad. So let's play on curve and go with this. Yeah, it's game. Got him. <coughs> Here we go. Again, the main source of gems is going to be ranking up now and hitting rank 20. See how long it takes. Just wasn't a good deck. I don't know what's with the chat today, guys. Who cares? Who cares? Let's just play and win. So it's a decent hand. Hopefully he doesn't start with a lightning bolt or he commits a one drop here. That's not so good actually. Ugh. Now what do I do? <laughs> it's actually a really good answer to Haunted Pumpkin. We pass, that's what we do. Not the berry blast is. Control Boogaloo. There we go. The Lightning Bolt is going to take out a guy regardless, so that's fine. I'm just going to be playing the game today. It's a pet eye. Okay, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, man? Gotta get rid of one of these. Wow. Wow, it's a pet, too. Look at these plays. Alright, this is really weird. Um, I'm going to... I'm going to feed him a card here. We're going to play this as a control deck now, actually. I'm going to put this here, too. We're probably going to block the 7-6. He does not have any more brains this turn. Uh, what we really just need to do is block this, squash this next turn. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? <laughs> There's nothing I can do. Now this is just going to charge the opponent's block meter. Ugh, this is so unlucky. Whatever. I might as well do this next turn. Do not, and he's rolling all, okay. It's gonna be booping this and trying to hitting him for nine before we proc a block. Watch him roll a three. That's just how that goes. We can actually make a good trade here, which is weird. Uh, should, which one of these should I go with? I think this one. <laughs> now there's a trade. Should have gone face, just missed lethal. It's okay, he's gonna win anyway. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> Damn, this pet deck getting it done. Pet Boogaloo is probably like the worst matchup. There's no way for me to play three minions here, right? Nope. Wow. 
really struggling after we hit rank 10. Oh, I had two threes and a one. We weren't gonna come back. Ah, uh, so we're 17 and 10 now. Sad face. Here's Brainstorm. Does not have the lightning bolt powers. He probably is gonna have some bungee plumbers, but not the end of the world. Alright guys, here's what's happening in the chat. I'm not going to be, if anyone goes and says, oh, rip Smurf account, oh, this is weird, you're getting timed out. If you start talking about games that has happened to you that has nothing to do with the stream, I'm timing you out. Uh, the chat is just getting a little too chaotic today. If you have a question or a comment about something that is happening here in the stream, that's amazing, but I'm not gonna, it's, it's just, no one's... Chat is a little bit insane today. Here we go. Um, this is the play. Enjoy. This can be a berry blast. Interesting. Nebula. I think in a different uh, run, I would craft Smash Sports. In this one, I'm going to be just concentrating on Agrisolar Flare. It's a rocket science. Cool. Give me something good, Z Wing, please. Please. That's not bad. Oof, against Brainstorm, not bad at all. Did have that blizzard. Problem with the lizard, it doesn't control what I play that turn, it only controls the previous turns. Which is why I never use this card. That was a pretty good seed link. Bad Moon Rising, really, really fun card. Great for free to play players because it is a grindable event card, too. So it's kind of a, a good, you know, RNG late game control, you know, ramp for the zombie side for free-to-play players, which is amazing. He blocks the five. It's so annoying. It's so annoying. I guess since we're running a deck that kind of needs to barely win, since we're running a very not optimal aggro deck, uh, the block meter just every once in a while is screws you. Should you craft mustache aggro? You can. It's not the, the best, absolute best deck in the game. It's pretty fun, it's effective. You could if you want. Aggro Solar Flare is a better deck though. Bad Moon Rising, good day sunset. Cool. Studying English, cool. Where do we go? Where do we go now? Where do we, where do we go? I guess next year we have Strike there. Really have to get as much damage out of everything as possible in this deck. At least the games we're losing are going quickly. That's the good news. He got that from... We got that from Quasar. What a great shot from Quasar. No 
just happened? <sighs> that feeling when you Rika is super scary. We just need six damage. This brainstorm is so slow. Wow. <laughs> That's what he got from Eureka. Okay. Please block. How many times has he hit me? <laughs> the block meter sometimes just screws you. There's nothing more to it. Ah. <sighs> Professor Brainstorm, just go! Opponent, I don't think it's a bot. Just a really slow human being. A human with a really slow brain. Not very lucky today. This is very good though, because that means we can do this. And this. And usually win. What what is he gonna have that's gonna do three damage? It's gonna teleport. There's nothing. I don't even know if there's anything in Brainstorm's arsenal. Teleport Swabby is his other two cards from Eureka. Did he play two already? Yes. Here we go. And we ranked up, so you get 20 more gems. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I think I'm going to try to win a game as the Smash to keep going through these quests. These might be really important. It's nice just to get more quests, to be honest. So we're gonna go to single player. Becky, let me smash. Let me smash, Becky. Oh, the sports energy is real. Slight sports energy. Uh, what's a good way of grinding event cards? So, uh, if you actually have multiple uh, devices, you can log in, back up your account with an EA.com account, <laughs> and uh, you'll actually get that special recharge jug uh, separately for all your accounts. You'll be able to get a lot of grind, grind a lot of um, grind a lot of, of tickets for that. Mm. Where do we go? Go get him, baseball zombie. Yeah, okay, baseball zombie, okay. That's all I have to say. Wait, is this ranked mode? I thought I was doing single player. Look, mommy, I'm stupid now. I'm actually in ranked. Let's see if we kill this guy. The type of music that I listen to, all types. Uh, I like hip hop music though. I'm actually in a ranked game. Uh oh. It doesn't matter, we're gonna win in ranked with Smash. It's totally fine. Ooh, look what he <laughs> got him. Baseball zombies are gonna be growing. Here we go. Here we go. If he has a three tech guy and he gets scorched, maybe that was a bad play. No! Baseball Zombie's dead! Wow, I'm so dumb. Why am I playing on the ground? Some freaking idiot. Why should I find everything so annoying today? 
It's possible we'll still win this. This guy doesn't have garbage. I'll do the daily today, probably not. Uh, Locust? Play around the uh, Smashing Pumpkin. He's running garbage. Healing this is probably the play. All the 1 1 cards should become 2 2. Is it true? What is this? Is this my stream? <laughs> yes, we're blocking that. Amazing. Let's try this in players. I'm not gonna win this game. Relics. MSN Bo Bowl? Okay. Welcome over from YouTube. That happened. Just want these to trade. I think healing our face is the way here. Just gives us a... Now it's gonna still take four shots for him to kill us here. We're just wrecking him. Monkey Monkey is sending a deck. Binary Stars and Bad Moon Rising really work well together. This deck could be okay, it's not going to get you very far though. You have a very clear strategy in how to win. Yeah, I'm not going to be making deck lists for just these little Smash games that I'm playing. Got this. Really interesting. Okay, keep me boomerang around. We need to block. Blocking is so important now. And that's nice that that's what he used his weed wag for instead of removing this minion that we're winning with. 
He's only doing eight to our face, plus we have a full block meter now. We're in really, really good shape. It's likely we'll be able to even make the dolphin frenzy and block something here. Let's see. Well, you do have PVC here as tier list in the future. Answer is a resounding yes. <gasps> no way! Oh, that's so annoying. Got an electric blueberry as a top deck. What am I supposed to do? We're gonna do this next turn. This is very sad though. Actually, for, yeah, we have to get a minion with two attack. We got one. We got one. If it has four attack in lane, more than four attack in lane one, we lose anyway. So we just have to rely on him not getting something with more than four attack. We should still win here. He probably does not have a four to um, a five attack minion. It's it's extremely unlikely. A berry blast would do it too, but that re it does it regardless. This is the play, guys. Now we need him to not roll a three. Yes, <laughs> we actually won a ranked <laughs> a ranked match with Smash. Oh snap! That's right. That's how it's done. Getting the tickets. That's the ticket. Wee stars, and we're on a win streak. Okay, what's the next quest that comes up here? Win two games. Okay, here we go. <gasps> what's the next one? Play two zombies that cost four brain cells. Anyway, screw that one. I'm not doing that one. All right, we're going back to Agro Solar Flare. We have 75 now. Let's see what's going on. Maybe zombies are just better. Or oh, up against a rank four guy. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Greninja. We need early game. Yes. So again, if he has the lightning bolt on turn one, he's not gonna have answers to two, three, and four. So this is totally fine. Play a backup dancer. Great hand. Starting off with Haunted Pumpkin Apple Saucer. I mean, even the most expensive version of Agro Solar Flare. It doesn't get much better than that. That is totally fine. I'm actually happy he got the heal one sooner than the uh, standard one and have the heal one in his either of powers and get it later and heal. It's totally fine. Cuckoo? Ah, so I might go actually two and one next turn. Uh, I do have ideas for new sub emotes. I made the badges. Yeah, I didn't do the sub emotes. We'll go. I don't know about Ancient Vampire and going viral. It's really hard to pull off because the Ancient Vampire is not doing anything immediately. It only works with going viral. I've tried that before. It just doesn't. It seems like it's just too hard to pull off. How often do I shave? A couple times a week. This actually trades well. Totally screw up the order. Nice. Nice. A little bit weird.
So three hitting us, not the end of the run. I think we'll save this for next turn when it's striped in. I'll actually do some damage. That's annoying. At least it trains. Comrade, I'm working on some stuff right now, so you'll see. Three, three, and three is probably how we win here. Aggro means do as much damage to your opponent's face as possible in a short amount of time. Tempo means slowly build up your board and be efficient like that. That's four damage. That's pretty good. He doesn't have another one of this. This does not really matter. We should win next turn with the strike through. Flamenco does not win. A dancer and a flamenco would win. Berry Blast. It's almost for sure gonna win here. Haha, <laughs> Soldier Boy to face. Face! Yeah. There's nothing he can have that would help her. Good old berry blast to face. So we're 20 and 10. Just really winning two and losing one. Which is pretty good. That'll get you... This is really the equivalent of like a... You know, 6 or 7 out of 10 win rate. Which again, does rank you up. We're going, going, going. We're up to 95 gems now. Hooray! Uh, so this is gonna be Wall Knight. There's no way to, yeah. Wall Knight's gonna be better for aggro. I don't think there's gonna be any early game spit out decks that are gonna help us, so. Here we go. The Guardian class. Because of Poison Ivy, I'm probably gonna stick to Solar Flare. Uh, we'll, we'll get another five gems soon. Yeah, you can go spit out Chum Cell, which is not good. You really, really want Solar Flare. Here's a rank 30 guy. But it is Super Brains, which means we have the favorable matchup. Not a good starting hand, though. Again, the problem with Colosseum and Ancient Vampire and Elite Things, it's a wonderful wombo combo, but uh, it's very, very hard to pull off, and the opponent can just have one removal card, and the whole thing goes down the garbage. I'm not going to be building multiple cards into one thing the opponent can just zap and destroy. Uh, it's never a good idea. I think we'll do this to play around Chop, actually. Maybe it should be playing around Beam Me Up. It actually trades with Beam Me Up the same way, so... Y pair is just a four four attack four cost card. Nothing special about it. That sur has a little survivability. <sighs> this is fun. Gonna wait till he commits all of his brains to play this. We want to at least get five damage out of it. It's deadly. Uh, control Spidel late game with Poison Oak. I don't know. You'd have to have ways of removing their minions still. We're just gonna still play around Rocket Science. Oh, nice. Rocking his block and hitting him with one of these sixes next turn is gonna be really harsh. Maybe drawing out his chop this turn would have been good. That would be a lot better. Oh, baby. Here comes Bad Moon Rising. 
Uh, if he puts one health minions on the ground, like brain vendors and stuff, he's dead. Don't actually have a double play here, which is sad. Uh, spamming unintelligent comments is going to get you uh, suspended from the chat. Really? Really? Bad Moon Rising. What is he doing? I took, uh, well, like, he needs a Zombot or something here. And he gets mixed up Gravedigger. I think it moves first, then shoots, and then mugs. And he's dead. There's no way to control these strike through minions. Even if it wasn't mug, even if it had been anything, it could have been Nurse Guard went to help. <laughs> he moved this one. Wee. You mix me up. I'm just going to say it's 21 and 10 now. Good matchup, by the way. Agrisilla Flare versus a Bad Moon Rising deck. He needed a miracle there. That was not... He would have needed Zombot. What else would have saved him besides Zombot against Strike Through Minions? Almost nothing. A really wacky gadget scientist. Okay, here we go. Here's the next one. When a multiplayer game gives you 100? Ho, 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 ho. Okay, so here comes pack number one. Oh, we're really getting it now. This next game, next win, we're going to get a uh, another pack. So, premium pack. When pack openings are exciting. I love having a garbage account like this. I can just min-max and I don't even care what happens to it. There's something very fun about that. Oh, we're going to get a, at least a super rare here. Weed spray. <sighs> okay. So, none of these help our Agar Solar Flare efforts. Uh, I'm not going to be running Water Balloon. Uh, Grave Buster and Wheat Spray are good cards, though. Really, all these. Maybe if we could... Super Brains. Anyway. Cool. Not a great pack. Uh, we can scrap the Weed Spray, though, and get an Elderberry. So I think I'll do that now. What else do we really need, though? Do we really just need more early game? It doesn't seem like the late game is where we're struggling. It seems like the early game is where we're struggling. So maybe I'll I'll scrap this. I haven't really decided what I'm doing for the one slot yet. But I'm probably not going to be getting multiple a wild berry. Huh? Like, what about just poison shrooms? Yeah, I can craft. I can craft four of these. It'll be better than sunflower. Take out mixed nuts. What would be better? Poison Shroom? Which is a really high maintenance card to keep getting value from, even though it is Solar Flare, so you have a lot of removal. Or go with Morning Glory. 
Let's just say poison ship. I think this is the way. This is gonna help our deck a lot. Just craft a fourth one. Ah, so we're gonna get rid of mixed nuts and two sunflowers and put in these three poison shrooms. <laughs> Maybe we'll just go with fourth. Poison Shroom probably is a thing. I just feel like we might get Poison Shroom in a pack eventually. Alright, let's do this for now. We're gonna open up another pack after we win another game here. Uh, and then we'll, then maybe we'll craft the fourth one. I got Weed Spray in my last pack. If we get a Warning Glory, I'll just run that instead of the Poison Shroom. If we have a couple draws, we can get it. Here's Rust Bolt. Really looking for a normal one. Take this. Poison Shrooms and Meets a Rolling Stone. A nice to Bungie Plumber, but said it's Morning Glory, so it's okay. This is fine. And them with the cheese. How do you know you'll get one super rare in a premium pack? If the first, if you only get four commons, uh, that means there's always a rare. There's always a rare. That means you're the, the sixth card. There's always six cards too, so it's either gonna be a super rare or a lucky. It's totally fine. We're wrecking this guy. This dude master swag. So sorry, if you get four commons, one rare, yeah, then the, the sixth card has to be something better. Here's Poison Shroom. Oh, good pickup. Giving us cards. Uh, this is a one, this is a sumo. This is always a sumo. <laughs> I think, is there any sports zombies that are gravestones that cost three? No, has to be a sumo. Uh, so we'll just do something that trades well with the sumo. And we'll put some more heat on his face. No, it's... Oh, I did not think of this, but it's still fine. It's actually better for us. Nothing happened to my program. Count, doing this for fun. What's good about Pumpkin? Four damage and two health on turn one. It's such an aggressive card. There's so much damage for its cost. Oh. It's just the direction, the way I'm sitting. Cup. Covering my face. This can give him alieners. Can't really do one damage. Landscaper. Chop. We're still still maybe lethal? At least we'll get him down to one with an empty block meter and strike through minion in hand. No, he heals. Oof, huge heal. If I would have gone with Pumpkin, probably would have won there, actually. At least he doesn't have Chop. I think this is a pretty good opportunity here. Hopefully he doesn't have a Rocket Science. Space. Taking a little longer than we would have liked. Not really lucky block, he rolled a tuna too.
lot of strike through. There's Rodeo Garg, so we should win here. If not, this Bloom Ring will finish him off. He rolls another three. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? So I can get super and oh come on man. This is so annoying. If we lose this game. He's hanging in there like a champ. It's gonna be you. Draw your card. It's gonna be this one. And squash. Do not have another beam me up. That's what he needs. It doesn't have a lot that could beam me up in rocket science to take out this pumpkin. Super to face will win, you're right. So that's another 50 50. No, it's not gonna get it done. Thank you! <laughs> Games are taking too long. Okay, we're gonna get another pack now. And we ranked up, so we get another 20 gems. Here's 100. Oh, man. I'm really happy I did these quests. I was like, I, I don't remember what these quests were. Now these are actually gonna refresh. Uh, we're gonna keep playing some games here. 5,000 scraps. You can buy Haunted Pumpkins and Going Virals. That's my suggestion. Uh, Alright. Next pack. Uh, I'm going to keep going premium. Most of the cards we need are still in the premium set. Here we go. Come on, come on, come on. We got Morning Glory. Jumping me. Not a bad card, wrong set though. Uh, so I'm gonna stick Morning Glory into this deck now. It's arguably, it's our, it's, it's, there's a couple situations that it's better than Poison Shroom. One is that it can make a good trade. It only does one less damage, and it's also a lot better in the light game. Nice. Uh, so we're gonna go to. I can, I can just recycle the cards we're not using. Uh, we can recycle one of these. I already crafted poison ivy. It's fine. Uh, I guess I'll recycle this since we're min-maxing our solar flare. Which I think it's a decent card though. And we're using morning glory. I can also recycle the grave booster, I guess. Unless we switch to aggro... Tell you what. I'm gonna save this for now. What if we switch to aggro walnut? Almost impossible, actually. Uh, so Morning Glory goes right into the deck. We will replace that with... <laughs> uh, I think we have enough for our fourth. Applesauce. Amazing. We don't need another um, Poison Sham, which is kind of why I didn't craft it. Uh, what is the next card we need? Seedling's a little slow. That's better than Seedling here. The next card we need uh, is Power Flower and Wild Berry. I wonder if instead of Wild Berry, since we're running the Poison Streams, we should just run Banana Bone. Wild Berry's probably still better. Uh, power Flowers and Wild Berries. How much scraps do we have right now? Those are both going to be hefty 250. Crafts. All right, let's just keep it like this for now. And elderberry, you're right. I think elderberry is actually the next thing we do. So, before we do power flower, we actually have some really decent early game now. Let's keep it going. Maybe I'll I'll make a deck list after this game a new updated one. Wandering is setting a deck. Uh, really budget Bad Moon Rising. Again, this will work on lower ranks. But on higher ranks, you're just not going to be able to sustain until you play the Bad Moon Rising. A fourth Bad Moon Rising will also be good since that's your win condition. Going up against Becky, let me smash. 
So one, two, three. This should be fine. The actually the elderberries also make the poison ivy. The poison ivy is the most powerful for cost uh, card in this deck. And uh, the the, it, it, the the downside of this makes elderberry basically makes the downside of this worth it because it gets fronted by a minion. Uh, Smash is a really really good matchup. Does not have especially on the budget level has no ways of dealing at least. Like, Super Brains can have beam me up and stuff. Smash has nothing to deal with these Haunted Pumpkins. This is going to be so freaking good. Three Peters OP for start. It seems like this. If he plays a minion that dies to Weedwag here, we are, we are, it's just game over. Extinction, again, this guy does not own a copy of Extinction Event. That is a super rare that is in a late set. Almost impossible. And if he does, he wins the game. Just play an arm wrestler, please. That is totally fine. We are going to weed whack that. Oh, he actually got this from our haunted pumpkin. Hey, he did it. He's a running ghost. That's fine. So again, that's gonna cost him two brains, and won't even really take out one of these. And we're just going to—he's not gonna have any way to deal with the poison ivy. This is great. He doesn't have chop. It's not like Rust Bolt and Super Brains also that have chop that kill this first poison ivy we play. We've been really getting hurt by chop a lot. He he has heal. Uh, he also can have smash power. But SMH stands for shaking my head. Like, uh, come on. Fireweed is is still a great card, even after the nerf. Even after the nerfing it from being a broken OP piece of garbage, a three three. Slip through the cracks. I'm gonna play around Alien News and go here. The next turn, Alien News? Who cares? Did he just get that? We're still doing five, despite him controlling my early game here. We're gonna keep the pressure going. that. See, Elderberry makes this play really, really good. Uh, I think because he committed, we'll go with here. You want to play this against minions and utilize the strike there, otherwise let's just take the four damage from him. Is Corn Dog good for control? It seems like it's okay. I haven't utilized that a lot, and it seems like there's better options. I should think about what that corn dog would be best at. Oof. So if he plays a guard here, we'll just smash it. for four. <laughs> Colonel Port, Colt Pulse, another card I've had a hard time finding a good deck for. It's just beginning to hit my face with double ones here. Gonna proc his block, I guess. Ah, this has gotta be the plan. Just running arena. It's a 3-2-3. Three, three. It's not a good card. Got the Diamond League with Smash Sports. Amazing. Keep grinding that with the going viral version and be able to get even further. That was such a waste! <sighs> not a good player. The heal is so good there, though.
Is Shamrock at a worth crafting? I'm gonna say yes. Make sure you have enough light game. There's no point in doing a control spit out deck unless you have a lot of walnut bowlings and you have to have some serious light game power. Three, a little off lethal. It's still worth it. Our super wins. Bounced off the field. It's not what we needed. Squash could be good. So that's guaranteed later. I will kill you with my button shroom. Benjamin button shroom. <laughs> To 55 up to rank 14 the stream has been going for an hour and a half looking for that early game slow water welcome thanks for stopping by I don't even know at this rank if this is a sumo I have no idea I'm gonna say at least we'll trade at least we'll trade no it's a rat <laughs> a higher rank I would have definitely fronted that it's just so low rank it makes it more likely that it's rats the Scorch? If he puts a dry minion, we're in the money. It's gonna be Berry Blast, actually. Favorite meal? Um, it depends. Are you going for taste or are you going for what actually makes you feel good when you eat it? Actually makes me feel good is like nice vegetables and meat together. Um, in terms of taste, I don't know. Freaking unhealthy stuff. Puff pastry and garbage. Is this fine? It's gonna proc our block. We're in real good shape. Grapes of Wrath, good late game. I, I haven't had a lot of success lately. I used to, I used to find it really good. It seems like control Spadal might be a little slow. It seems like you really need like a big hitter like Walnut Bowling. Really single-handedly do all the damage.
Should I just squash? Really might just squash here. Nuts of berries. Nuts of berries. That would be a piper too. This guy gets a rank 15 using decks like this. Maybe this is his alt deck. This is fine. Ooh, I probably should have gone face with that. Whatever. Healing his face. Decent. I think this is the play. Look, Mommy, it's two different types of pumpkin. It's time for Thanksgiving. Favorite pizza type. So again, don't eat a lot of pizza, both for health reasons and for lactose intolerance reasons. But uh, really just classic pizza is my favorite. Sometimes if the spinach is baked into the cheese, that's nice. But uh, not a big fan of pineapple pizza. Sorry, guys. Mm, ooh, he's doing a lot of damage to us. Where's Berry Blast? Uh oh. Uh oh. He's healing his face. Blaub. So you got. If we use the scorcher. We need a lot of damage though. Maybe developing this is good though. Giving him more cards at this junction is really bad. I think I'm gonna use this just to preserve one health on these two cards. It's a little sad. Uh, I could use Bloomerang in. Squash synergy? Yes, this is definitely a squash thing. This is when you need power flower and stuff like that. Uh, we're in we're in really good shape. The heals have been killing us. The problem is these monsters he's conjuring from these haunted pumpkins are gonna come and bite us now since we're not really winning. Uh, I do have a parrotlet, a little parrot. <laughs> it's just an orange deck. It was great. Apple saucers would be nice. No, he had all these cards in his hand and he does nothing with it. Wow, that ended a <laughs> Anticlimactic. What happened there? Here we go. So we're still getting bonus stars, right? Yeah. Three at a time, baby. Keep it going. <laughs> Sad moment. This is fine. Brain Freeze. Our first match against Brain Freeze. And we win. <laughs> I'll count it. I don't care.
We're counting, we're counting even stupid losses in this. We're going for overall wins and losses. We actually ranked up, get 20 gems there. How efficient. 24 and 10. Feeling that as this deck gets better, our win rate's gonna... Win percentage is gonna go way up. Here's a Super Brains. Super, super nice to see Super Brains. Now, against Super Brains, the, we actually get rid of the 5 attack one first. Uh, we really, really want early game here. Very, very, very bad. Favorite hero? Probably Huge Giganticus. Silver Flare is right up there, though. If we get a 1 or a 2 here, we'll be fine. We have to play this the slow way. Now we have a brain advantage, disadvantage. Should you save for a 10 plus 1 pack or buy one at a time? That's the big question. Um, it's possible he has a chap. Still possible he has a chap. This is so sad. Uh, so if you're doing what I'm doing, just trying to hit a high league as fast as possible by one at a time. But if you're trying to slowly but surely build a huge collection, uh, so it's definitely more efficient to buy buy a thousand gem packs. I like huge tuches, and I cannot lie. It's true. I can't. I can't lie. Still playing around shop, I guess. And if we're gonna continue to improve this deck, we can get to Ultimate League with it. We're gonna try to craft some um, elderberries. That's okay. Wow, he has to beat me up. So he has some really good cards here, and we have a really crappy starting hand. If we would have had a good one and two, we would ha he would basically be dead by now. Man is whack. So at least flying out the card advantage a bit. Uh, we think he's still holding Chop though, because he hasn't. We haven't seen a power from him yet. <sighs> he's just playing gravestones. It's so annoying. That's, this is. The Probably get the Imp Commander back. It's a pretty decent firefighter. He used Stench? Oh, you're right. Never mind. I'll try to get him with the pumpkin next turn. Thanks, guys. What do we get? Applesauce. Nice! That's actually exactly what we want here. My goodness, here comes Swabby. Yes, yeah, still no chop. That's actually better. One chop is better than two random cards, probably. Ugh. Fire Rooster. Did he get that from the Haunted Pumpkin? It's possible this smash will win next turn. We roll a one. Ah, oh, it's so bad. No way! What a horrible top deck. Now we lose the game. Now we need 
Uh, we might as well just go for it. We need a block and a... Wait, we already got super and weed whack, right? Button shrooms and scorch. But scorch will save us. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> That's a loss for us. That's what they are. GG. <laughs> oh, man! <laughs> I love this community. We're just a bunch of meme lords. We play nerdy video games. Ah, uh, nothing better. Carp is sending a day. Sports. With the uh, vampire, I can't argue with that. Sports deck looks fine. Ah, uh, we lose, right? I'm counting as a win. I don't care. See, it's not about how well a particular deck performs. It's how does your experience ranking up go? We're counting that as a win. <laughs> There's gonna be luck. There's gonna be getting unlucky hands. There's gonna be unlucky block meters, and then sometimes that will happen. We actually won. Got it. I was about to concede. I was about to hit that button and concede. <laughs> Got him. Got him. I don't care. Uh, I don't think Scorch saved us there anymore, though. Did it? Okay, here we go. So this is a huge Giganticus. Ultimately, Q Gigantic is great. Instant karma. I should just concede, right? Actually, Acro Solar Flare is a really, really, really good matchup against this deck. We need a Haunted Pumpkin. Damn it. We need a two. Oh. Yeah, I know. I should update the deck list. This ha if we would get ha some early game, which we hard mulliganed and we didn't, we have enough early game. Didn't get enough wild berries yet. Uh, I'm going to update the deck after this. That's a good idea. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This, we we actually have a really good matchup against HD here. He doesn't have Chop also. Stupid Super Brains Chop. Maybe this is even a better matchup. This is very doable, you guys. I'm going to put this on Heights. What is he going to do on 2? This is really, I don't, even though we're against someone in Ultimate League, we can really pull this off. Hey, Adagy. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. What's going on? I don't even know who this is. We can't even tell if this is someone from the stream. Nox doesn't load names. Okay, there's Rocket. He can't control this 3-1, though. This thing is going to poison shroom. is wrecking him. I'll update the deck after this game. It's good idea. I just forgot to do it. This uh, the pair of pair is actually a really good card against HD. We also have three and one. That's fine. I have laser beam in here. This has four damage. This is incredible. We're gonna get as far away from that parasol as possible. This is very, very doable. Actually, even though we didn't have our haunted pumpkins earlier, this is a pretty decent hit. No idea what kind of deck this guy's running. He hasn't played cards. What has he played? I'm throwing up. This is fine. I'd rather just go into the water. It's fine. We have laser beam coming up. We have all kinds of stuff. He already used his rocket science, which means his laser beam is going to be better. We're still hitting him for four. That's a temporary measure. It's nice that his parasol stuck all the way at the end. Ooh! So he's gonna go after. Interesting, he goes face instead of taking out this minion. I mean, instead of preventing face damage. Uh, I would have I would have gone after this Africa there, I think. Who's that? Keep the lanes open. 
strike through? Doing tons of damage to him. Teleport. It's probably only gonna teleport one minion in. Does he have a second? Not necessarily. This will mean getting him down to two, getting him within laser beam range. That's totally fine. They also have getting him down to home. Oh, we're in real good shape. He already used his freeze environment. His block guy would be so good. Yes, that's perfect. We that is exactly what we wanted to see. That is so much better than getting the guy and preventing the four. Now, super wins the game. Laser beam wins the game. Could really use a two here. Oh, okay, so this is better. We don't need all the damage. He doesn't really have a way of healing. Might see a bad moon rising here. There's that. Huge commitment. But that's it's it's gotta be lethal here. We're gonna go with the uh this eight. Yeah. Is this fine? What card could he possibly have that would save him here? Okay, any two cost card could cost one at this point. We're still gonna block this, that's fine. And that's guaranteed lethal for us. <laughs> so we get matched up when we're about rank 15 against a uh, ultimately huge guy, Giganticus player, but that is the power of Agro Solar Flare being such a strong meta deck. We pull off the fair and square victory, and that was without getting any early game either. Got him. Absolutely got him. Stop complaining about bad matchups, guys. Okay. I'm exaggerating. That is a that is a perfect, a late game, really slow who Giganticus deck. It was really bad at controlling Agro Solar Flare. That is exactly what we wanted to see. I'm going to write that down as a mini highlight, maybe if I ever make this to YouTube videos. Um... Versus. Very nice. Okay, now I'm gonna go back here and I'll just take a little deck photo here. Keep it going. We're at rank 16 already. I'll, I'll just fix this deck list up a little bit while we. Well, this next game starts. It's on four lines, so I'm not even including the. Idol of the deck here. Uh, free to play solar flare aggro. This will be like three, I think. Uh, need a mulligan. We got a one. This is actually a uh, okay too. Okay, this is fine. One, two, three, four. There's that. Do we super that? And, and get a 4 2 in next turn. I think we do, actually. This is a rank 5 HG? <laughs> Slight contrast. How does he have it? This is like probably someone who used to play a long time ago. It hasn't played for a few seasons in D-Ranked. He probably actually has a better collection than uh, it would seem. This is going to go on Heights for now. It's our highest attack, guys. You don't want to get frozen by his power. Are you a gamer girl? Yeah, I'm a professional gamer girl. How did you know? Probably he's not going to have any deadly minions. Oof. There's that. Frozen inside with Okay, this is the play. We're going face with this one. And I'm going to put Morning Glory here so we can uh, Berry Blast this and prevent... Actually, I guess I could just Berry Blast this immediately. Should I wait? We can, that, now we can play Bloomerang next turn. Alright, let's just do this. This actually wins the trades. So we still have two attack here. No, this is fine. Hello... Mr. Cosmic. Oh, love you too. I'm a gamer girl. In a game of world. Oh, wow. Haunted Pumpkin's a huge pickup here. Because now we can go Bloomerang in one, Haunted Pumpkin in four. Ruining this guy. Uh, so I 
didn't update the deck list yet. Just gotta find it here. I just the name of this deck in my deck list is free to play aggro solar flare three. That is fine. There's Ao Gucci five. Really weird. I think we. I think we'll do like this. Get a good trade. Why not? Damn, please don't get guy. Yes, that's the that is the best case scenario. It's just squashes now. Nice. Probably just gonna squash every place on lane three. Yeah, getting this in right now, that's a weird squash. Uh, getting this in right now is going to make Bloomerang win next turn. Oh, if that hurts. When they get the answer to Haunted Pumpkin from your Haunted Pumpkin. Sad. Please raid Area 69, Daddy. Now he has a teleport, which hurts a lot. We're gonna have to rely on him getting more. Uh... We actually have five and three next turn. It's so weird. He's doing six to our face right now. This is not gonna be easy. Does he win? Close. Wish you were good at streaming. It's practice makes perfect. I wasn't good at streaming when I started either. Uh, so we're down to one health. We're in really bad shape. We're gonna need a miracle now. Now? We're gonna need a miracle. He has teleports, he has all kinds of stuff. I think eliminating the bullseye guy from the equation is the way. Should have squashed this one and take the one and three. He has two teleports. So right, so this never hits face because he has two teleports. So eliminating the bullseye, giving us the one and three, is better. He teleported a gravestone. You gotta get a dry minion in there, dude. We're down to one. The audio is a little bit weird. Uh, I, that's why I have it so low. He doesn't have any minions. He had no... Now we're gonna win? Oh, gosh. This is doable. We need a strike through minion right now, or a berry blast. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Here we go. <laughs> Highlight City, babies! Here it comes! Oh, so sad. Top deck madness. That was so tense. That was so tense. Wow, that might go into the actual highlight reel. That was crazy. How did he not have a play? Oh man, that was insane. Ranking up again. I'm going to make that into a legit highlight. This would be win number 27. Man.
that was a great, great moment. Oh, oh, pack, pack, pack. Still, most of the cards we need are in the premium set, so I will stick to my guns and keep buying premium packs. Here we go. Um, we get nothing. <laughs> no plant cards. Let's see. How many, how many raw zombies do we have? Uh, if I use a gravestone deck. Do we have enough for uh, our first uh, elderberry? We actually do. So I'm gonna go and craft that now. Should I be doing the daily challenges? I already missed one. You guys wanna see the daily? Is it a puzzle party today? Oh, it is. So everyone wants to see it. Um, so I'm gonna go to this deck right now and, ha and craft actually our first, um, I think it's Elderberry. There's a lot of extra strike through power that we've been needing, so I think I think we do this before the blooming heart. We'll do one of these before the wild berries. Are Elderberry. Okay, so we get rid of you. You are useless. Elderberry. Great card. Great card. Uh, I'll do the daily real quick. Why not? It's not part of our speed run, but. That's fine. I kind of want to do this, do this strat again, and um, I kind of want to do this and win. Um, what the heck? And like, instead of going for aggro solar flare, I'll go for like smash sports or a, or a gravestone deck or something like that. Gravestone deck might even be the easiest. Things ain't looking very good. I'm taking miracle beat zombies at this point, much less in one turn. <laughs> What? Jester? Line dancing zombie. It's smelly. I presume this is gonna go here. It depends what we get from heal. Is this RNG? Like we need, we need, um, do you always get heal here? If we get heal, we'll win. Not signal, not signal, does not block line dancing zombie, but it does block. Oh, well, no, we don't, well, we don't need to block it. So if we go here. We go here. Let me go here. No, wait. No, the one procs are blocked. Did I mess that up? It depends what you get, though. Is there a, a rigged superpower? If we get Geyser, we'll be fine. You always get Walnut Signal? How am I supposed to know that? Did it say that? You always get walnut signal. How am I supposed to know that though? So the way that you'll do it is by putting the body Gordon two and uh, no, you'll put the body Gordon one, the mirror nut in two, and then the nut signal in four. It's rigged. It's rigged, okay? Hey. Well, if we redo this, we'll get the, um... Okay, I'll turn off the volume. We'll get actually 10 gems. Ha, ha, ha. Worth it. How do you quit? So we do it here. Do this here. 
Let me do this here. Because this will do two damage to his face, and then this will do the remaining 18. Look! I know you get wall in the signal. If you get geyser, the, the way I did it before was right. Wee. We're going to end up with 20 health, mommy. Yo, dad. Oh, sorry, the sound is still Okay. All right, this counts. Get 100 tickets. I don't think a forget me notes is going to help us, but 10 gems does. Oh, baby. Play three nuts. I don't feel like it. Okay. Wait. You've unlocked all the starting plan heroes. Buy premium packs. No problem. Why did they give me that message there? All right, guys. Oh, two hours. I kind of want to get to 20 today. We have three more ranks to go. Eh, maybe I'll stream a little extra today. I will be back. I'm just going to take a few minute break. And we're back. If we do win every single game right now, it's really just five more matches until we hit rank 20. We have to win all of them, though. We're up against Witch. Uh, I do have an Elderberry in this deck now. For those of you just joining us. Man, it's so nice having a somewhat optimized deck here. We did not get a 1, unfortunately. But then what? You don't need it against the Morticia, especially if she's good at controlling your ones. There's that. We will use this just to give, get ourselves. Getting ahead in the sun here is going to be fine. Okay, we'll do a little vote in the chat right now. Who says I should upload this to YouTube and who says I should not? They're going to be about three-hour videos. It's basically going to be the whole stream. Um, yes or no? Yes for upload, no for no upload. Uh, this should be fine. Seems like we're about 90% yes. First time I did this, no one watched it, but yeah, it's a different day. Mark it a little smarter this time. Wow, look at this. Crazy. I think this is the play. It's worth five damage. No, because the deck doesn't change. I change every once in a while. YouTube, you're welcome. That's how we do it. Didn't have a trick last turn. Dog. Wow. Okay, so they trade, but we're still that can actually win with double ones here. Let's do a trade though, at least. In fact, no! We needed a power. We would have won. We actually would have won there. <laughs> Come on, man! Uh, Scorch wouldn't have helped, but we it would have had been we went, because it won in three. Do this, huh? Uh, I guess making it. Oh, we actually have strike through. Never mind. Never mind. Do you like this? Do not give your phone another card here. Apple Saucer is such a great early game, late game. Apples, it's an uncommon card, too. What a great card. And that is way too slow. It's guaranteed lethal. Alright, so we're up to 28. I think it's four. If we win the next straight four, we're getting three. Again, we're in. We're under rank 20, so it means we're getting bonus stars, getting three per shot. We have three ranks. 
starting with these three stars we get. So that's 15 stars, which means five games. So if we win four more games straight, we're gonna hit it. Thank you so much. Disco Master, really appreciate it. Welcome to the family. She could watch all day. That's fine. Extra overtime streams. Grizzly Bear. Here's a Boogaloo. This is not the matchup we like. Uh, this is a good enough hand, though. Uh, what should you buy premium packs of Galactic? I think you should start by buying premium packs. Once you have all your basic cards, I would say then buy a few Galactic. It's good to get some some environments, and there's a lot of very useful cards in the Galactic set. But if you're really going for Legendaries, uh, go back to and Super Rares and Legendaries, I would say go back to Premium, because that's where the really, really top tier cards, the Super Rares and Legendaries, are in Premium, like Pine Clone and, and Friends. We're going to play this. Um, I could play this in Heights, because why not? Just playing around uh, Trapper territory. In case your opponent does not have a lightning bolt. So far, every Boogaloo we faced today has had, a, had one of the lightning bolt's starting powers. Getting back of dancers or evaporate is the best case scenario. Yes, please, miss. Even if he hits, though, it's not that bad. That was perfect. And those back of dancers are going to be charging our block meter, so we're going to be getting our little powers actually really do help us. Um, empty lanes and stuff like that. Amazing. We're in such great shape. Here comes this one. Doing just fine. Hello, Emblan. Oh, I play Minecraft? I don't know. I don't have time today or tomorrow. Show collection? I'm min maxing. So if you want to see all my good cards, they're all in this deck. Maybe I should have done that, though. Wow, we have our one Elderberry, which you don't even see in the deck list. I just added, have not updated the deck list yet. What other games do I play? This is basically, I play Overwatch, too. I should maybe do, like, the most popular games on stream, like Minecraft and stuff like that. No, I'm so stupid. I should have played more Spore. I'm so dumb. Darn it. Unfortunately, I think this is the play. I should have played Morris for. This, is fine. this actually gives gives us the Elderberry next turn, which is real good. Uh, I'm probably gonna keep doing this free to play count tomorrow. No, I don't plan on doing Fortnite. That's already dying. I like the real, real popular games. Maybe I'll do something. I don't actually own Minecraft for PC. This one has a spirit copies. So I'll send them my way. Kangaroo! Wow, not a great play by him. This is four, this is five. This is five. Don't want to put the Elderberry that dies here. Might as well utilize the Poison Ivy. I should do squash the face and kill it. It's just five. Let's see if he commits a huge card here. If he does, we have so many answers. If he commits a small card, we'll actually do the upgrade. We have a lot of possibilities. This elderberry has a lot of value here. Four doesn't really matter here, does it? This just has a little extra health, it's better. He has alien. No! Wrong one! This still does three! And Prox is blocked, dude. Really? 
No, Elderberry is just gonna win. We are killing everyone. I kill everyone. Best packs are premium. We can get a little galactic if we need that. Um, with one, you can do a bungee plumber with one. So I would say this is the play. I don't think he has anything that can take this out. Does Kitty have his superpower in his hand? Does he have an unused power? Eroy! Eroy! 29 and 10. We lost it like the first two or three games we played today, but we have not lost since. Never played Dota. Is this why to craft Elderberry? Yes. Should I just take the deck list and be constantly up updating? Here's our deck list with our one Elderberry. Keep it going. <laughs> Maybe I'll just keep up updating it every single time. Why not? It just takes time out of the stream. Alright, Mulligans. One, two, three. This is a decent one. It works. I'm very blessed. Should be fine. Can't see where. Wonder if our opponent plays the arm wrestler here if we super in. Probably do. A one, two, two is just fine though. Happened. I think this is fine. <laughs> Premium packs. Tricky. Am I subscribed to most amazing top ten? No. no. Oh, look at this play. Look at this play. With the magnifying, one magnifying grass in here. Oh, so good. Neutralizes this, puts three more heat on the field. We're gonna have five next turn. Gotta get huge Giganticus. It appears in the shop every once in a while. Uh, having a non smashable minion would be good here, so I think I'm gonna go with the magnifying grass. Wrong one? Ugh. So this procs a block and this kills him. Maybe not though. Well, block smash kills this. I don't think he's gonna have an environment. Nibble maybe? I think this is still the point. He should have run to the morning glory. He has a rolling stone, that explains it. We still have this 5 1 on the field. But the, and the 3 2. <laughs> We're so far ahead. Uh, probably just gonna go with the 6-5 on the ground now. This will be a good turn for it. I don't think he's gonna have Eclipse. There's not a lot of people with total Eclipse on this level. Rank 13. And we go Berry Blast, actually. Negate the Baseball Zombie. I think this is a good play. We're gonna need... We're not gonna be doing Lethal anytime soon. Having an empty lane for this... Uh, pumpkin is really good. This just makes a very good trade. Come on, Camel Cross. We're close to, I mean, what are we now? How, how many games did we win today in a row? I'm not sure what our win streak is. I can check, actually. How many games have we won since we had our 10 lo 10th loss? We were uh, 17 and 10. 
So right now, since 17 and 10, we are 12 and 0. Which is a baseball sign. <laughs> There's Logos Storm. <laughs> Needed that for the smash. That could let me smash. Let me smash. This is the real let me smash. Bloomerang, bloomerang, let me merang. I don't even know what I'm saying. It's a sports animal deck, it's like every basic smash deck. We are killing this guy. Are you gonna get the note 10? No. <gasps> Pet synergy. Oh, come on. Thank you. I didn't feel like playing against him anymore. Alright, so now we're 30 and 10. I think it's two more games until we hit rank 20. Which will make for approximately a two and a half hour stream. Pretty good. Which means it's, it's shorter to get to 20 than it is to get to 10. BS. Should be two more games, and we're gonna get the big, big money at rank 20. Oh, ho, ho, we're gonna get it. Just gonna craft wild berries and stuff. Here we go. Just brainstorm. I guess we'll keep this hand. I don't think you get rid of elderberry here. These are really sad against brainstorm, but so is haunted pumpkin. Rank 22 brainstorm. I'm really budget brainstorm. I'm not afraid of high level brainstorms are the scariest guys in the game, especially against this. But he's not even necessarily running bungee plumber in this deck. Because if he's running tricksters, he's more likely to run bungee plumbers. This could just be some random science deck. It's fine. Science is good. Science is good on this level, but uh, it's going to be too slow. Let's see, has some serious beam me up value. Let's just keep going, phase. Another one. Brainstorming step lightning bolt. I know that was so broken. Best hero having the best. Secondary power, basically, in the zombie side. Ah, uh, this is actually the play. I'm gonna die to Scorch next turn. <gasps> Damn it. Good chickening. Decent! health is gone. <clears throat> Please, one health. Yes, yes, mini ninja is usually good, but not this time. This will be a 4 3 still. We are in. Oh, snap. We are in great shape, guys. Great shape. So it's Scorch. We're going to get use out of these ASAP. Um, I think we go here so this survives. And this will proc our block. Wow, we're in great shape. How does it shape? No, that's a huge beam me up. That is humongous. Uh, this elderberry is gonna get some heat. Real heat. This is fine. This is fine. This elderberry. This 
So it's going to be Berry Blast, whichever minion, non-gravestone minion he puts in one or three. Then Elderberry in two, I guess. Or just Berry Blast face. <gasps> no! No, it's the it's the Nox glitch. I was gonna win this too. We were gonna win. We were so gonna win this game. Don't play on Nox, people. It's so bad. It's the Nox glitch, and I'll count that as a loss too. No way. I have to restart the game now. <sighs> there goes our our win streak too. So now it's gonna take. Don't lose stars, but it's gonna take three games now to hit twenty. Uh, I'll restart the game. Just give me one second, you guys. Nox is the emulator that I use, an Android emulator that I'm doing my Smurf account on. I don't feel like deleting the game on my main account. Yeah. Why am I playing on Nox? So again, I usually play Screen Mirror from my phone. Um, I would have to delete the game from my phone and reinstall and, and do a whole thing. It, it would just be, I, I just don't, I, I really just don't feel, I don't feel safe at this point, especially because there's not a lot of support with this game, just deleting the, my main account from my phone. Bluestacks wouldn't even run. I couldn't even get Bluestacks to start up. Okay, here we go. That was annoying. We had that game in the bag. Rust Bolt, not bad. I just gotta watch out for Chop. I don't plan on playing Zombie in this account. I'll, I can do that next time. I can do the Zombie version. <sighs> That's a pretty good hand. These are all very strong cards against Rust Bolt, so I'm gonna keep them. If we get a removal card, I might go with this. See, so this doesn't. Rust Bolt doesn't really have a way of dealing with this until turn two. Gladdy Daddy. So this is the play. Gotta get rid of the Gladdy. But we will have Weed Whack, Poison Shroom next turn. Parallel Space app? Oh, you're saying there's an, there's an app for my on my phone. Is it gonna be laggy? You're right though. It could be I could uh, create a new Android instance. I don't. I've never done that before. This is okay, that's actually the first game as we've had internet issues before, but it's never been the Melva game, so it just happens with Nox. That happens. This is what he got probably. So it means we is in the shape. He's in the good shape. I think we go with this instead of the three two. Three two is better later. We really want to get value out of this while we can. We do not want to use the Wee Whack on the two one. We have to use that offensively. Uh, we might go with the 3 2 and the Weed Whack here if he just puts a minion. Very weird that he stuck that in the water, though. He should have went after my Hunted Pumpkin there. Glad you're enjoying the f stream. That's Vey Vamp. Thanks for subscribing. Really appreciate it. Very strange. Uh, did he use a power? No. I'll go with this. Uh, if we get super this turn, I'll probably kill the three turn. So who cares? Okay, so he's running. He has super. Huh? I'll probably put this on YouTube. We're in amazing shape. This is end of turn three. We've already depleted half of his health. And not anymore. <laughs> Block! Yes! I'll take it. You don't want that growing yet. Uh, so we'll have these two, or a squash if we really need it. If we get Elderberry, we have a good target for it already. We don't have any environments. I think we weed whack this and then we squash next turn. And we'll keep utilizing, keep getting value out of this 1 1. 
In which case, he probably would have, you know, upgraded something onto it next turn. This is fine. Never mind. Even though we could squash the one that he upgrades and make it a 2-4. Oh, we are doing 7 to his face. Stream snipe concede? Nah, don't do that. We're we're doing the a legit experiment here. If he upgrades something here, it's squash poison shroom. It's fine. The one here does proc the block. It's charging his block meter. Is this a sports card? This is just fine. Squash. There's no point in doing this. What's better, aggro budget, aggro budget, controller tempo? Again, it, everything has its good matchups, but this is the uh, aggro solar flare is one of the best budget decks in the game, probably the best. Especially if you're trying to do what I'm doing, it, which is climb fast. Thirty-one. Man, we're doing it here. Coliseum is such a. It's not a good card. 3 3 would make more sense. So we're at 19, we need two more wins here. <laughs> we're gonna get a lot of gems. I don't know how many gems he gets. 200? I, I don't even know. But we're gonna be getting some. This deck is gonna be basically optimal once we hit rank 20. <sighs> I'll play around shop, get rid of this. That's a great hint. That's just a great hint. So nice having actual early game instead of freaking Sunflower. <laughs> Here we go. Let's go on the ground. We'll eventually use this button shrimp to clear this lane up. Maybe with something else too. I have a feeling applesauce is just gonna go on height soon. It's 250. That's a lot of money. Gotta keep going face. So probably the poison ivy. Uh, it's gonna hit face next turn. We need to roll high though. See, rolling double ones hurts. We just need Scorch is all we need. Get rid of this Doctor Who. He's rolling threes and I'm rolling ones. This this could be a loss just because of that now. Uh, I guess we block the Doctor Who here. We're, it, we really just kind of have to slow it down. Oh, it's so bad. It's nice he's chipping our block meter. We just need a block. Man, we get it. This is fine. Now we actually have some stuff. Uh, what's going to happen right now is Bloomerang and and the power, I think, to clear this lane and proc the blocks. So Bloomerang and four power and power and one and two. <sighs> You're so annoying. What am I supposed to do? Darn it. Two and three? Forget about the strike through. I don't have a play next turn, though. I think two and four is the play next turn. Alright. We're gonna go with button shrooms. <sighs> Actually, this killing one of the button shrooms is fine. This is a little weird, but I'm... Um, does he have super? Oh, he might have super. Okay, I'm going with this. This is a little wonky. That's fine. This will proc the block, do four, and then we'll have to strike through minions next turn. No! <laughs> He's holding telepathy forever. Did he roll a one? We are, the block meter is screwing us so bad. So bad. Oh, this is so bad. Okay, so this will hopefully, oh, now what do I do? I think this, Urgh. we don't need the strike through here. What was this deadly fire rooster? We need something to take this out. All of our power is due, so we need to not roll a one. Even Scorch would be just fine. We'll take the five damage. 
We have strike jumping this next turn. That's rocket science. Hurts. Please roll a two. Fine. We already got more spore. <sighs> what am I supposed to do? This is a classic example. Every possible thing that could go wrong with a block meter went wrong this game. Everything. I am saying freaking everything. There was no. What am I supposed to do there? Anything? Any takers? This is so bad. Okay, we actually still are in this game because we have four. Oh. I don't even know. No, that is actually really bad. So we have. We have to do this now. His pogo, so he wins. There's, there's nothing I can do. There is nothing I can do. Maybe he'll disconnect. Maybe he'll concede. Out of pity. Again, we should have won that game. That was a great matchup. We had a great hand, and the block meter just totally shoved, shoved it up our tuchus. That's all that happened there. Man. Did he roll double ones at the end just for style points? <laughs> Synopsis. Wow. First Neptuna. If I rolled an eight, I would have won. Never know. It's a hard card to take out. I'm worried about Simo though. That's a nice hand. Here we go. Great matchup. Again, Neptuna has a... This is the bane of Neptuna. She has no way of dealing with this. Maybe Simo on the next turn, which is very sad. Oh, it doesn't go for it? Okay. 72% win rate? Including cheese. <laughs> oh, this is perfect. This is exactly what we needed there. I think we weed whack that. I don't know what the plan is, but let's try to ruin it as soon as possible. Nice. Average blocks. Everything's fine. Uh huh? Yes. Uh. Oh, this is better, this trades. Keeping the lane clogged here is actually worth it. This one would have kept a, a minion of his on the field, and the headstone carver can actually get some decent value. We're anyway just proccing the block this turn. The difference between 3 and 4, we have a way of protecting this again next turn. We actually have 2 and 2 right now if he puts another dry minion, but if not, we are going to... What if it's Pogo? I guess it doesn't matter. If it's not Pogo, this is better. Tomb Razor. What's the best Platinum Hero? Uh, on the highest level of the game, Nightcap is, but I would say Solar Flare is number two. Noob Tuna. We should win this turn. Those are small gravestones. And the home of love. Ah, this is strike through next turn, so I might as well just break that. That is a <laughs> high diver, and this is going to be a two coster. Ah, uh, there's no two costers that save him. Alright. There's that. Too easy. This 
solo flare wearing a shirt? Oh, she is. Has a leaf on it. Was that the one? No. We need one more. No, wait. Yeah, we need one more. Okay. Hopefully, this is the last game. The three hour streams intensify. Is there a glitch in the Matrix right now? There. Don't need this. Here's HG. Good matchup. Good old matchup. This is nice, but we probably need it too. Nice. Don't stop streaming. You can watch this all day. Oh, you guys are so nice. Put this on the heights just so it does not get controlled by his freeze power this turn. Wow, he just wasted. This is going to be so valuable next turn. Was he going to stick a Doctor Who in here? Horrible play. Wow, and we got a 3-2. And he doesn't even do it. Congratulations. So what I'm going to do here is I'm actually going to weed whack that Doctor Who next turn. We'll get the 3 damage into this turn when we can. Uh, we basically have 1 and 2 next turn. Which will free up the pumpkin, remove the next minion he plays. There's that. So this is worth it to weed whack this. It just negates this card. He does have a really cheap Leggy in hand right now, but uh, it is turn three and he's going to be down to probably nine in an empty block meter. We're in such good shape. Yes, this is why Elderberry is so valuable. That's fine. Do not care. I'm just gonna win. <gasps> we counter it. Now. We can squash it next turn if we want, but it's better just to hit him in the face. This is the play, right? Yep. Barrel of barrels? It would be decent. Okay. But we have we actually just need to hit him with the, with Zabricot one time. Wow, <laughs> that hits too. You're annoying. This wins next turn. I think preventing damage is probably the play here. Damn, Yeti! Wow! Oof! Okay, so we have to... Okay, that's fine. Seven and seven wins. Okay, we're gonna have to rely on blocks now. We can't put the laser beam in front of this. We could crush it and delay one turn, maybe. I wonder if crushing it is the play. Crush it and use this and then do this on turn 7. Not gonna have anything to remove it. Who knows? Maybe he'll just play a 6 drop here. This is kinda rough. Happens to be blocking is good this turn. Because blocking usually makes us win. With the 4 damage. Okay, I'm gonna crush this. And we just need four, four or five damage. We have an easy five damage next turn. Oh no, so we don't want to block. So I'm going to put this here. I don't want to charge his block meter again. I think this is correct. If we played squash, he would have a, a one in three chance of just winning. This one in three does not win. In fact, we almost always win here. No way! <sighs> if that's another Yeti, we're just gonna lose this game. Might as well play around it, though.
A two attack bullseye minion would win. <sighs> we got so unlucky. We got so unlucky. Are you kidding me? If we would have just rolled it normally, we would have won last turn. I can't believe that. Oh, one more. The struggle's real. The, oh, come on. We've had some BS games today. This deck is doing so well. That was BS garbage. Holy moly with that. He happened to have Viking in hand, too. Come on, man. Give me some early game, please. Probably another Ultimate League player here. Horrible hands. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? That is so annoying. I wouldn't mind. Ugh. He's gonna go Secret Swimmer. I don't like that. I think he let that hit, even if he has Synchronized Swimmer, but maybe he's just relying on that. That's fine. Please give me a... Th okay, this is fine. This is actually really good. Now we can chump block that. If all goes well, we'll get him down to 11 and empty his block meter. If he doesn't have a good way of controlling these apple saucers, we're, they're going to take over the game. Please do not roll a 3 and a 2. Please block. I just want us to statistically block. I'm playing with statistics. I'm playing this fine. It's not working, dude. That sucked. <laughs> I think it's better than the three getting blocked, but still. It still sucked. Big sucky, sucky, sucky. I don't know. Okay. We just need to be as aggressive as possible here. We're not going to win this. Too bad of a starting hand. And see, if, our, if we would have blocked, we would have him down to eight now with one charge in the block meter. Now it's ten with no charges. I'm not sure if it really would have made a difference in the day. He had got such a strong start. I think it's squash as the play. Stupid. Well, I know it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's okay. Everything's just fine. Uh, try to survive for some reason. <laughs> Bonus attack. <laughs> Uh, there's nothing that can actually save us here. Actually, no. 2-2 two, two, block. Uh, probably not gonna die. Next turn. But there's no one drops. <laughs> Got another freaking smashing pumpkin. That is why you need power flowers. Alright. 
Still one more game. At least you don't lose stars at this rank. Frustrating. It's gonna uncrimson it. Once you hit 20, you start losing stars, and you only gain one per. The grind is gonna be real. This is better against Brainstorm. You need a one. Yes. Yes. Okay. Great hit. Great hit. Gotta go aggro. Enjoy your monster. Happens if someone gifts Nightbot us, though. You can try. Then I can make Nightbot do the emotes. That would actually be useful. He has Quasar. Do I miss the grind on this game sometimes, but this this uh, this is how I satisfy the desire, you know. This poison ivy should hit here. If this is an even trade, I'm just gonna let it go. Your internet was trash. Budget wall night decks. This is gonna be very similar to this one. Wow. Go. On the ground, let him hit us first block, see what happens. I hear all the three. This is where it all goes wrong. Come on! <laughs> there is no deck in the game that is more sensitive to the block meter than this one. Except for maybe a, tr a trickster miracle deck, because you also just have to hit him four times and win. Well, no, you never, you don't need him, you don't kill him in four times. It's all going horribly wrong. Let's go! Newspaper? Nice! We can berry blast that next turn. It's actually... It's like the best case scenario. Another beat me up would be really strong here. So we nibble. Free to play can reach Ultimate League. I'm probably gonna get to Ultimate League with this. I'm definitely gonna be able to get to Tiger. That's what he got? Wait. Oh, and he gained an extra brain. So annoying. I'll do this next turn, I think. Just getting this getting within bungee plumber range, it's not end of the world. Actually, these two will kill it. 1-1. One, one. Hmm. Maybe doing this was good. Some weed whack with it. Gone at the... If we would have done this, we actually would have had a better play this turn. Okay, this is still fine. Well... I save the berry blast for face? It's a little bit weird, but I'm going to. Because if we hit the five, which we almost always do this turn, uh, three kills him. Lord, I don't know why you're always such a cynic. Why is that weird? Very blessed wins. Rolling one, yeah, huge there. He's going for Batman Rising. I don't care. Alright, guys. Pretty good run. Um, 
I guess I'll do the, 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 the pack buying and stuff at the end here, so we'll start off with a very op optimized deck next time. Here we go. Maybe Wall Knight would actually be better. We're going to the next league here, so let's see what we get. If we're going up a rank, you get 20. If we're going up a league, you get 150. So we got 170 total. Which means we're going to buy two packs right now. Gonna stick with the premium ones. That'll bring us right to 235. Let's see what we get. Still going with premium packs. Wow, getting some value. Getting a leggy. <laughs> That's going right to scraps. But this leggy, it costs like all this is all the cards we need right now. We actually have. Think about it. Basically, not exactly. Uh let's keep going. I'll buy one more, and then we're gonna make this day. It's fine. We're just gonna scrap it. It's totally fine. Here's another premium. And our rare. Uh, would I... Oh, we actually got another Poison Shroom. It seems like the Poison Shroom has been better than Morning Glory, so maybe I'll put the Poison Shroom in. This is probably not useful. Okay, this is fine. So what you do to this deck now... Got Winter Melon. Uh, we'll go to here. We'll recycle the Winter Melon. Big time. Big fat recycle. It's a thousand. Amazing. So I will go over here now. I'll, I'll do this again tomorrow, guys. Don't worry. And we will start optimizing our deck. I think I'm going to get rid of this and put in a fourth poison shroom. I think that was better. Um, what class is... Which set is Banana Bomb in? This is Galactic. I actually might buy Galactic next. How about all... Okay, we do need Power Flowers. We right now have Scraps. Uh, for four rares. So we can either get Power Flowers, Elderberries. Or Wild Berries. I feel like a little more early game, so maybe I'll get two... Maybe three... Th three. How about three Elderberries and a Wildberry? I feel like we do need a little more early game. It seems like the late game has actually been fine, and the early game has been a little bit... A little bit icky. So how about two of each? How about two of each? We'll go... Let us recycle. Or we can just get one fireweed. Or we can get one blooming heart. I don't think it's worth it. So, for the purpose of this deck, I'm going to craft two wild berries. I'm running berry blast in my early game. So this goes away. This goes into the deck. Uh, I think these have been the problem, though. We'll get rid of all of these. And we'll craft two more Elder Berries. Is there any reason to run the berry angry? Is there anything that it's better than in this deck? I don't think so. Well, let's break there. I wonder if berry angry is better. Are the squashes too slow? Probably not. Well, maybe they are. Is berry angry better than squash? Is this card better than squash? Since we have sixes in this deck. I think this card is better than Squash, though. It's 
gives us a little extra early game, since we're only running the two wild berries. These are nice finishers. Alright, this deck's looking good, so this will be the deck that we use next time. Amazing. So, it was another, it took another three hours to hit rank 20. Uh, again, this deck is just getting better and better. It's slowly forming into the uh, budget Agra Solar Flare, which is such a powerful deck. I like the way it looks. Main thing we're missing now is Power Flowers. Power Flowers, two more Wild Berries, maybe. This is looking pretty good. We've got the removal. The removal actually is nice since we're running Poison Shroom and one. But anyway, Pair of Pairs. I think the Pair of Pairs is better than the Spine Bear and the Squash. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed, that was absolutely amazing, so uh, hopefully next time we're gonna start the grind to rank 30. This is real hard mode, because when you lose, you lose stars and stuff like that. Let's see what happens, hope you guys enjoyed, peace, this is Fry.